Hi, my name is Anita Cotrere and I'm a board certified family lawyer. Today I'm going to give you a brief overview of the divorce process. The first step towards getting a divorce is filing a petition for divorce with the court. The petition is the document that starts the process. But before you can file a petition for divorce in Tarrant County, you have to have lived in Texas for at least six months and in Tarrant County for at least 90 days. Once the petition for divorce is filed, you have to give your spouse formal notice of the lawsuit. This is called service of process. The law requires that a process server or a sheriff's deputy hand deliver the petition to your spouse in person. It's not enough that you or your attorney give them the paperwork. Sometimes people need to have a temporary hearing in order to stabilize the family until there is a final decree of divorce. Mediation is often part of the divorce process. It's almost always required before you can have a trial in your case. Texas law requires that you wait at least 60 days from the date the petition for divorce was filed before the court can finalize the divorce. Many divorces will take much longer than the 60 days because the parties cannot agree about how to divide their property or who will be the primary custodian of their children. The divorce decree is the document that declares that you're divorced and outlines in detail the property division and the parenting plan. Your divorce is final on the date the judge signs the divorce decree. In many cases, your divorce can be finalized without you or your spouse ever having to set foot in the courtroom. But for that to happen, you have to be represented by an attorney. Again, my name is Anita Cotrear with Cotrear Wanger. For help with your family law matters, please call us at 817-285 2855 or send us an email at katrer at familylawtex.com.